What's up, Tech Number here from Triple Shoot, and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'll be tackling a somewhat common issue that you could be experiencing with Visual Studio Code. Basically, I need to change a setting in Visual Studio Code. The setting for me is changing the default terminal program from PowerShell to Command Prompt. To do this, I simply click the arrow, click Select Default Profile, and I choose something else here. But you'll immediately notice an error in the bottom right. Unable to write into user settings, please open the user settings to correct errors slash warnings in it and try again. If you're getting this error over here, you may be very confused of what's happening, but basically your settings file is slightly corrupt or something is wrong with it. All you need to do to solve this is click open settings and on the right hand side, you'll be looking for a red icon such as this, suggesting that there's an error down here. Scrolling down to it, Somewhere around the center of your screen, when you're roughly centered on this icon, you'll see something in red like this. You can also use your cursor over here to select the correct line until you find the line that has the error. Anyway, when you get there, all you need to do is solve any issues on that line. Immediately, they may not be too apparent, or you may be confused. Usually hovering over the line will give you some information of what's going wrong. In this case, it's saying unknown configuration setting. Very odd what exactly could it be? Well, scrolling down further, you see the same exact thing down here, except and ignore, except and ignore, and it looks like they're copy pasted from each other, nothing's too wrong. Here's where you need to understand a little bit of JSON notation. If you're very new to this or very new to coding in general, simply look around the rest of this document in places that don't have errors or something similar to this. As you can see inside of brackets, there's an array. Each of these items inside of the array are surrounded in quotation marks. There's no quotes in the middle of it. And there's a comma separating each one. They're inside of brackets, open and close. Everything seems fine here. The previous line ends in a comma. So the next item in the object would probably work fine. You can tell it's an object because of the braces over here. Everything looks fine in here, but of course you could be missing something very small. In this case, for some reason, the colon after ignore quotation mark is inside of the quotation marks. Fixing it as such fixes the error and we're basically done here. Now, of course, the error may not be too apparent to begin with, but of course, if you understand what's happening inside of the JSON document, which hopefully you do, then you'll be able to fix this issue. I didn't create this issue. I'm not sure what program did, but it stopped me changing any settings in Visual Studio Code until I was able to manually fix it. If you see something like this with a bunch of yellow lines underneath it, saying something about incorrect type, usually these can be ignored and they're not the cause of the issue. You're only really looking for ones in red. Now, if I were to go back to here and select my default profile once again, you'll see that things just work properly the next time I open it up. I'll open up the terminal and there we go, command prompt. My settings have been saved and things are fixed. Hopefully your issue will be a bit more apparent than mine was as this tiny little change did confuse me for quite some time as I didn't see it immediately. Anyways, that's about it for this video. Thank you for watching. My name's been taken over here for Troubleshoot and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.